Hey guys, RC here, back with episode 28, Football Manager 19, the Victor Orta Challenge. We are with Workington AFC, coming off a 3-2 win over Scarborough, where we got goals from David Symington, Glenn Kerr, and Jerome Jolly, and a 2-2 draw against Gateshead, Mulatto, and Chris Owen with a late equalizer. So we're heading in. We have with the draw, we fall into second position. One point behind Halifax Town. They have one draw, one loss. We still have the best goal differential, so that will help us moving forward. Uh, let's see. Last match was Darlington and Egham, so that was 9 4. Uh, let's see. So Logan had just come in. We saw that. And then we've got an offer out on Joe Lilly. And we had an offer on Elliot Holmes. He rejected it. So we, we didn't even look at him. And Lilly hasn't accepted, so we won't look at him either. But let's get to the matches today. So we are slight underdogs at home. Good weather. Uh, let's see. So I don't really want to go attacking. All right. Kerr and Clark up top. Avon in the middle. Uh, David Symington, who's one of our team leaders, uh, he is on a non-contract, but he has uh, approached us about a new contract. Again, I cannot offer that. So I ignored the first email. Second email was from the general manager himself. And of course he has the rights he set up in the game settings that he makes all the decisions. And yet the game still has him asking me, do you want me to sort this out? Well, duh, that's why I've got the settings like they are. So I told him to go ahead and resolve it. Uh, he said that he would, uh, I got the email back from him saying he had talked to the player and had promised him a new deal. So we'll see how that goes. Kerr still working on his match fitness. If I was uh, like Marcelo Bielsa, uh, then I would, oh, speaking of, um, I forgot to do that. I've been recording and stuff this morning. Um, so if I would have, if I'd be like Marcelo Bielsa, I'd send him to the U23s. Hold on, because I forgot. I've been recording and stuff, and I forgot to see who won the match. It was not televised today. Come on. Three to two. Yes, three points, baby. Who scored? Uh, Clark picked up a yellow card. Let's see. We... All right, we went down. This is Leeds United, by the way. That's who I follow. So Thompson got a goal for Millwall. We, we had gone like 52 matches without a penalty, uh, without being awarded a penalty kick. Like three or four matches ago, we got our first in like two seasons. Uh, we got one today, and we missed it. I don't know who. I'll have to find that out. Pablo Hernandez scored the equalizer. Uh, Luke Ayling got a goal and then Pablo Hernandez got a second goal. So he ended up with a brace. Nice. Uh, they also got a goal from Marshall. Oh, so yeah, we, uh, so they went up 2 one. We, we equalized in the 71st minute and then got the winner in the 83rd minute. So that's big standings. That means we move. All right. So we're back up into second. Two points above Sheffield United, five points behind Norwich. So we basically want Norwich to run the table, and we need Sheffield United to lose. We've got six points between us and West Brom. Playoffs isn't the issue, but I, I you know, we really want automatic promotion. We don't want to mess with the playoffs, right? But that's big. That's big. All right, go out and prove a point, boys. Can't believe I'd forgotten to see who won. Yeah, 
It's only been over for a couple of hours. All right, we pick up the first shot. Um, that's supposed to be the league table, yeah? Maybe? Maybe not. Alright, we don't have a whole lot going on here, fellas. Alright, Symington, it's knocked away. Smith, oh, what a beautiful ball over the top to Walton. Wide of the target. We got lucky there. Symington Pollock with quick yellow cards. Cobain across to Mulatto. Out to Owens. Into the box. Headed down. Clark off the keeper's hands into the goal. Javel Clark, his fifth of the season. Nice goal. That was a nice pass inside by Owens. Ah, good job, fellas. Yeah, we're not going to give a shout at halftime, I don't think. So 9-2 to two on shots, 70-30 on possession. Wow. Go out and prove a point. Watch your step. Oh, you know, it feels good. You, you want to be up, you know, so I'm glad to be up. But that one nil, man, and you know you're just one misstep away from eating it and having to settle for a draw, letting them back into the match. Um, let's bring on Devitt. And... Um, let's move Olsen outside, mid left. Yeah, we could do that. Holiday and then Jolly. So everybody will just slide over a little bit, keep everybody in semi-natural positions. Feeling good there. All right, Jolly. Oh, knocked away. Hoofed out by the defense. All right, Owens. Back to the keeper, Tire. Played out, Cobain. All right. <laughs> Clark, oh, off target. Nice ball. Murray. Let's try to keep yellow cards off. That's what we're gonna go with this match. All right, Murray into the box, headed out, Holiday, over to Mulatto, over to Owens, into the box. Oh, he's off target. Poor finishing. 19 to 4. We're going to drop back to positive here. Just blow the whistle. We'll take one nothing. We should have dominated this match, but you know what? You take the win. <laughs> At least we didn't get F FM'd. All right, we appreciate the efforts. Good job. We'll be back for Chester in just a second, guys. But that does get us through the second into the third qualifying round. So I'll let you know who we draw uh, here next match. So I'll see you guys in a second. All right, guys, we are back. I was actually getting I started recording and then... Uh, I clicked on this and then the phone rang. So we drew Stainstown in the next uh, cup leg. So they're currently 11th in the Evo Stick Southern League Premier South. That just rolls off the tongue, does it not? So that is who we drew there. Uh, and I think that's it. So we're back to play Chester today. So let's get to it. Match preview. We are slight underdogs on the road. Excellent form. Fair enough. 
Uh, so let's see. And we're second in the table. Not too bad. Team selection. I think I'm going to go with this same four. Well, do I want to go there? We're underdogs. Maybe I'll go here. Hmm. Maybe. All right. You can you can stay there. Physicality. What is his physical ability? Not great. Four goals in eight, two assists. Who's my other, my other striker? Glenn Kerr. Kerr's got a one and one. You know what? Yeah, he's not as strong. He can play a pressing forward. Maybe I want attacking mid right. Yeah, let's take him off. Kerr. Let's start Kerr in this one. Let's give Kerr the start. We could do that. And I think we're just going to go central defenders here. I think that helps us. All right, let's get to it. And if you're sitting there going, hey, you shrunk, I'm just kind of reclining back in my chair. Um, still to where my corners are not compromised. All right, encourage the team and kick off. All right, we're in the red. Kickoff highlight. I'm calling it. There we go. Come on, boys. A couple of early shots. Possession advantage. Praise. They got overwhelmed from the praise. Oh, my God. Matty Hughes got injured. Thigh injury. So he is off. Get creative. Oh, come on. Put it in. There it is. Oh, my God. David Simington. Need to put that in the net. Ugh. Uh, encourage, but then I want to tell the offense. No, not that. Uh, attacking. You can still get better. Kickoff highlight. Weird. All right, are we going to have a proper highlight here? Mm. Simington sets up a corner. All right, and the highlight continues. Nice, nice. There's a run. Come on. Banks. Jan and Michael Banks. All right, throw in Owens, Kerr, up to Holiday, lays it off to DeVitt, Banks, through ball into Kerr, brilliant. Hey, Fred, Kerr with the goal, his third of the season. Good job. We will take that. That puts us top of the table temporarily. Oh, he headed it right to the other guy. Shit. A long shot. Goes wide. Did we touch it? I think so. Shit. That was probably going wide. What are you doing? Just playing around. Oh, a nice tackle by Avon. And then he hoops it up into the stands. 10 to 3 on shots. Uh, get creative again. Let's make a sub. 
Kerr's playing well, but he is knackered. So let's bring Clark Clarky in. Uh, let's see, mid center and mid left. We could bring Jolly in for Mulatto, and then Holiday. There we go. Thought we were going to be bringing. I'm I'm sitting here recording because I thought we were going to bring the cats, uh, the kittens in for, uh, for an adoption event today, but the group that we're fostering for uh they lost their paperwork so they have no records of them even existing in their system so she can't have them out for adoption um so that's that was uh disappointing all right banks nice chest down lays it off to clark puts it away clark his sixth goal on the books 2-0 that may salt this one away with 25 minutes to play. A little early to maybe call that, but all right, we're going to praise him again. Symington to Banks. Oh, what a shot. Warren Banks with his third goal of the season. Now I'm going to call it. There was the nail. That was nice off a throw in. Cobain, Symington. Oh, just two one touches. Throw in one touch pass, one touch volley. Nice. 12 to 3 on shots. 10% possession advantage. Looking good. Let's go ahead and pull somebody off early. Who's somebody we don't play? Oh, we don't play Guy Jenkins at all. Um, marking. Heading's okay. His pace is not very good. So let's move him to defensive left for Chris Owen. There we go. We'll get him a, we'll get him a game. He'll pick up, you know, 13 minutes or so. I don't this might be his debut. I don't know that I've ever played him. I don't remember playing him. We're getting into some match congestion here with the cup action going on. All right, there's the ball up to Leasley. Nice. Nice block away. Murray clears it. Coming right back, though, but they reset. Oh, there's a good tackle. Well, nice block. Jolly holds the ball up. All right, there's, oh, Clark was about to take a step on him. That could have been a breakaway opportunity. All right, you know what? We're going to come back to balanced. Oh, no. Keeper got his hand on it, went off the crossbar, went right back to Davis. His third goal of the season. 3-1. We lose the clean sheet. I'm not horribly concerned. Okay, now I'm concerned. We're going to go back up to attacking. <laughs> two, two goals, two minutes, and there's three minutes left. That's, that's troubling. Five minutes of stoppage time. All right, just... There it is. Ooh, man. Well, they made it exciting there at the end, did they not? Um, all right, we do appreciate your efforts. So we have Matt Locktown, ninth in the table, coming up next. That win put us back top of the table. Only team without a loss on the record. Hello. That's pretty nice, huh? Jenkins made his professional debut. Uh, Warren Banks, one goal, two assists, four key passes. So we're going to say he was pretty darn good. And we're up to nine in a row on our unbeaten streak. Top of the table, one point up. Uh, we are getting a little spread here. So that's seven points to fall out of the playoff. So that's good. So, you know, we're, we're solid in the playoff. And again, all we're supposed to be doing is avoiding relegation. We're, what, nine... 
12 points off of that, so that's great. Board is at 65%. Uh, overall, oh, the grounds. September. Oh, that's uh, that's our new stadium. That's right. Uh, what else? Anything going on? Very secure, 68%. Cool. All right, where do we come back at? So I think I'm going to go on a long run here. Uh, let's get uh, maybe through October. That'll be about seven matches. And we can come back maybe right at the beginning of November for Hereford and St. Knottstown. I think that's what we'll do. I may come back, you know, it depends on how much recording I get done. Um, maybe we come back at the end of the month, but but I'm thinking let's come back uh, for the beginning of November. That's my target right now. But man, what a nice, that's beautiful, is it not? It's a beautiful thing. And one more look at the squad. All right, so Clark and Symington both with six goals. Six and ten, six and nine. Very nice. Very nice. All right, we will see you guys next episode. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new. And as always, you guys swinging by the channel, I do appreciate it. Uh, appreciate you taking time to watch my, my videos. And uh, leave comments. I'd love to hear them. And as I always remind you, I'm still small enough to answer them and care about them. So talk to you guys next time. Bye.